Okay, hi. It is Infinite Possibilities, um, and for this video, uh, I am going to try and see if the Volcano Vaulters also drop the Rodney back piece. And if I am correct, um, I will be the very first person, uh, at least to my knowledge, to have uh, the, the Rodney backpack, um, the latest uh, super ultra rare item to be added into the game. Um, so it's 7.05 in the morning, and I recently finished a nearly seven hour live stream. And, you know, I was covering the patch notes as well as uh, recording the entire uh, Rodney uh, squirrel grind, which um, took a very long time. It took like three and a half, uh, four hours for myself to go and complete it. And um, anyways, uh, I recently learned uh, that the Rodney uh, item, it's only dropped by gold crates. And uh, again, to my knowledge, uh, to my knowledge, I did the mathematics behind it, and the developer, Devin, uh, double-checked, and according to this, uh, the Rodney item has a 1 in 720 chance. Um, it is, uh, it is um, 2.33 times uh, easier than the Bandito hat, and uh, it is still an S plus tier item, or it is still called a super ultra rare, whatever uh, you want to go call it. Um, the classification for that is if uh, it's only dropped by gold crate. Uh, why am I doing this? Um, well, the thing is, uh, we have there is a strong reason to actually believe uh, that the Rodney item also is dropped by these the monkey vaulters as well as the volcano toads. They both share the same drop pool. They both drop uh, commandant commandant pants. They also drop um, the red leviathan as well as the neutron shirt. So we do have reason to believe that, and it's not just that, it has happened before. So for example, when uh, the Kiva shirt was first introduced, um, people thought it was only the Slizzards who dropped that item. However, in fact, it was the, however, in fact, the eggplants also dropped the Kiva shirt. Uh, additionally, another example would be like the mayor's top hat, where where people thought it, w it was despite those arachnids at Mount Blackhead. Meanwhile, uh, the Sonic Scorpions at Mark Yu Row also drop it. As well as, uh, finally, with the Toxic Spawns, as well as uh, the Bandito Hat, which are both dropped by the Scoria Cephalopods and the Terra Claws at Fuses, Glare, and Labyrinth, respectively. So we do have precedent of this happening. So they share the same drop table, and I just want to make sure if this actually is the case. Um, yeah, so that's the end of that. I am going to... Uh, do this. I'm gonna have my timer right here, and I have my three accounts, um, 14 minutes, and we should be able to go at a speed three times as fast. Um, you know, I have a gaming PC, but for some reason, when I load the fourth account, uh, it does not, uh, it, it does not reciprocate. So I'm gonna let's just get some footage of myself um, trying to go kill these monsters. Okay, so I actually have uh, this idea where I'm just going to go and record myself uh, and I'm going to go dramatically uh, speed things up. So it's display capture, you can see everything that I'm doing. And obviously I'm going to blur out some parts just in case I leak any uh, important information. But uh, I'm going to really show you uh, how long it takes to go get this. So the idea came at like 7.14 and yeah, we're going to we're gonna go begin. Okay, I actually made it uh, from 19.20. Uh, 1080 to 1280 by 720 because I want to go save uh, you know storage space. But yeah, I'm just gonna go record uh, the entire thing. I'm gonna turn off my mic, and uh, I guess I might as well also listen to music.
went by a lot faster um but then again uh so like last time i had to go open like seven to eight inventories i was more towards the lucky side and i managed to go get one after roughly five four inventories so that's great um so what this means is that uh this place uh definitely does drop uh the squirrel um definitely drops let's go open this one right now and we have two gold crates right here and i'm glad that i you know recorded uh the entire process just to go so evidence um that the item does drop and again it does not drop from a from from any other type of crate it only drops from a gold crate so even silver crates uh it won't be dropped and ooh, com commandant pants commandant pants okay so that's good um right, so and it's my partner and how many inventories did it take three four five let's just uh you know put cut that down to four and um yeah we're good all right so we now have this important valuable knowledge um where is uh plumber infinity and okay i can't wear it so i might as well go give it to her and it costs 844 taros that's interesting and uh Wow, Super Saiyan Goku to the rescue. Um, yeah, so here is uh, the Rodney J. Squirrel. Confirmed. So yeah, thank you for watching uh, this video. I believe I'm probably the first one um, to, have, uh, to have obtained it from the Volcano Vaulters. If not, um, I'm definitely within the first three or first five. Um, so I'm glad that I made this information public. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, please subscribe. Uh, please check out the Discord server uh, as well as a universal guide inside of the description. This is Infinite Possibilities, and I hope to go see you again next time. Bye.